Hey guys, Swamp Fox here. Okay, um, the the capture operation quest to, you know, capture the Zora Magdoras. Uh, the Elgato software that I was using um, kind of went huh, and I was unable to recover the actual gameplay. But at least you can watch the cutscenes. Uh, and if you guys have any questions or you know, uh, you know, need any help with the actual mission itself, just ask in the comments usually respond within a, an hour or two <clears throat> a couple tips uh, all the ammo and stuff for the cannons and harpoons are located like to the back of the cliff um all right let's uh let's watch the cutscenes let's again apologize but i want to give you guys something so if you're watching the playthrough you at least have an idea it wasn't just like a time skip Yeah, the harpoon and cannon ammo are all located in the back of the cliff. You have to go physically bring it to the cannons and ballista to, to shoot them. Help him. Mm. Work faster, you slack to life. Mm. <laughs> Quite Keep a sight. Uh, just wait till we're finished. Soon, I hope. Yeah, the second fleet always delivers. Hmm. Hmm. This is gonna work. Chief! Commander! So? We'll get it ready by morning, I promise. I'll hold you to it. When the time comes, you know what to do. The operation will commence at daybreak. <laughs> Sounds like we got our work cut out for us, eh, old man? By next moonrise, Zora will be in chains. Get to your posts now! All right, then there's, uh, you know, the part where you shoot a bunch of cannonballs and then he gets through the first barrier. This is the end result. <clears throat> you gotta attack the uh, magma cores. Uh, I recommend hitting them just a couple of times, running away, waiting for the lava <clears throat> to hit or, or to go off, and then you know smack it a few more times. You're not gonna get all three of them down. Don't don't worry about it. Just uh, do your best to stay alive. There also is some uh, dragonite ore around him. Definitely get that. Yeah! Woo! 
heat from the first! Master! No way! Now looking forward to fighting. All right, guys, we'll start the <clears throat> back to the normal uh, questing and stuff. Again, I apologize. Uh, there's no real way to repeat the mission. Um, and even if I join someone else for the mission, it won't show the cutscenes. So, you know, kind of sucks, but at the very least, I was able to show you something. I am not looking forward to fighting that thing. It can regenerate. I'm not okay. Let's get council underway. First, your reports. Where do we stand right now? Since it breached the Great Ravine, we've lost track of it, sir. The situation has made it quite difficult for us. However, I think we have a chance to salvage the situation if we can pick up its trail on the other side. I've got some good news from the field team on that front. Tectonic movement from when Zora passed through created a fissure in the Great Ravine. That fissure is our ticket to catching up with the beast. There's no point. We exhausted our supplies during the last operation. Even if we did track it down, there's no way we'd be able to pull off anything of that scale. Hmm. Then what should we do, Commander? We'll have to send a ship to the Guild. A ship? But with the skies and seas the way they are. It doesn't matter. We cannot proceed without notifying the Guild of the situation. We should send word and wait for their decision. Captain, can I count on you? Never you worry, sir. I've been watching the sea churn and waiting for my chance to tame her again. It seems that the fissure in the Great Ravine has not only given us a path, but an opportunity as well. Together, we're going to brave whatever lies on the other side and find Zora Magdaros' trail. Hunters, head to the Great Ravine as soon as you're ready. May the Sapphire Star light your way. Dismissed. Well, at least he's ever the optimistic. Gigante. I wonder. Hmm. Oh, I went about as expected. See what. <laughs> 